If you only knew the power of the dark side. What's going on everybody? Welcome back to the channel. It's the baddest man on the planet, the human juggernaut himself. Damien McCloud, aka the Alpha Wolf. So, who remembers back around July-ish of 2017 when YouTube was filled with so much drama and fights and I'm gonna kick your butt and you're gonna get your butt kicked. All this rhetoric and fighting going on. It all started with uh, two guys. I remember Kino Body versus Brandon Carter. Whatever happened to that fight? Hmm. So I remember someone calling that fight out and it never happened, huh? I remember? Yeah. But now we have a new era of fighters. We have KSI versus Jake Paul. Or is it Paul Jake? Or whatever the f fuck that kid's name is now. I want to take you back. Back in time. We're going to click on this shit here. We're going to listen to this clown ass dude right here. <laughs> this is crazy man this is crazy check this out so Grego Gallagher wants to get his ass kicked now and that's cool I can help him with that uh here's the thing Greg challenged me he challenged me to a boxing match because he made a video on the ketogenic diet that was just so wrong it was full of inaccuracies. Oh, keto snap, that's something to fight for, right? Would you now would you not fight for keto? I'd fight for keto. <laughs> alright, alright. Now listen, listen, listen. That was hilarious, but I wanna scroll down just a tad bit and show you guys the baddest man on the planet got top comment for calling out this fraudulentness. I said right here. There you go, Damian McCloud, aka the baddest man on the planet. So I'm calling both y'all out. Don't be dis don't be disrespecting the art of fighting for a few subs. I will both y'all ass. The call out video is live on my channel, which it is still. And um, you can see here, 314 likes, <laughs> 87 replies. I do kind of want to go down some of these replies. We're not gonna dwell too much on the haters. You know what I'm saying? There's gonna be a few leaving some comments here. But as you can see, some of your kinfolk over on his side of the world, you know, they feel the same way. They can't stand when a badass motherfucker like Damian McCloud steps up, head up, chest out, and calls out some fraudulent shit. Now, just gonna scroll down here. You can, uh, this guy has, you look like four foot nothing. I gave you, I'm, I'm about four foot of something <laughs> mama joke for the win you see how quick i am with him so when you guys come over here talking shit don't think i'm sitting back uh rehearsing nah that shit's right off the top of the dome ah uh, that's what your mom said anyway we're gonna keep scrolling down you can just see look at what i look at the trigger look at the trigger that's the power to manipulate a man's mind that's power you can't buy that's the power of fear when a real motherfucker steps up, <laughs> we see they all went to the channel, saw my first few fight videos. They was triggered. It was a holy shit. No, 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 no. We can't let you in this. Nah, so check this out. Look at this shit. These kids were triggered. Triggered. And I threw a few things in here every once in a while just, just to keep them going. Look at them. Seven months ago. Triggered motherfucker since day one. Uh, look at this guy, Damien, I don't understand why you are whoring for views. Hold on a second. Whoring for views. So Grego Gallagher wants to get his ass kicked now. And that's cool. I can help him with that. <laughs> I, I think that's whoring for views because the shit never happened. Just like I said a thousand times. Don't be disrespecting the art of fighting when you're not going to be fighting. You know what I'm saying? Oh, man, that's crazy. But now we got a new crew going in. Now, these guys here, I'm going to give them some slack because these guys are purely entertainment. Even though, you know, Kino Body and um, Brenda Carter, I mean, um, Brandon Carter, they made you think they were actually really going to fight. Not a fight like I hate you fight, but they are actually really going to box it out. Now, we already know that Jake Paul 
they're not really gonna box it out now this is all just for fun this is how he rolls so we're gonna cut him some slack these guys you know this is all fun and games if you watch a jake paul video the dude's just having a hell of a lot of fun all right so this isn't even like oh you know no disrespect to the art of fighting here this is all pretty much stunt shit which is cool but let's check it out anyway because it's funny it's about the fight of the size of the dog fight robert yo what's up dude is that robert frank Oh, she slapped his fucking hand away. Hold on, I gotta play that part back. Out of here! The fight in the dog. It's about the fight of the size of the dog. Fight. Robert! Yo, what's up, dude? Get out of here! Get out of here. <laughs> Shake my fucking hand! You ready to fight or what? Robert, calm down, bro. I don't calm down! I'm here to get you fucking ready to beast mode some. I'm gonna cry. <laughs> Holy shit. <laughs> hey, man, this might actually turn into a real fight. Fucking around with Robert Frank. He's no goddamn joke. I think if anybody can get anyone revved up for a fight, it's Robert fucking Frank, man. Dude is 100% octane. <laughs> yeah, so check this out. Remember this? <laughs> Remember this ass open right? Remember all that shit that Conor McGregor was talking? I'm the, I'm the best in Ireland and uh, shut the fuck up. You got your shit molly whopped. And that's a real fight. So we didn't get let down. Brandon Carter, um, Kelly Body and Brenda Carter. I mean, Kino Body and Brandon Carter. I keep getting the names mixed up. My bad. Um, they were, you know, setting their so-called fight up to happen around the same time this was going to go down, right? But it never happened. They called each other on the phone and said, dude, yeah, dude, hey, dude, 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 okay, dude. And then, you know, that's it. That was pretty much them saying, this shit's not real. But I was expecting to see two good fights. Well, we got to see one good fight. We got to see one Irishman named Conor McGregor get knocked the fuck out. I mean, damn, if the referee would have stepped in just... Two seconds later, I just give him another 10 seconds. Floyd would have put him on his ass. We would have had a meme of him swimming around the beach like they had Pacquiao when Pacquiao got knocked out. <laughs> they had Pacquiao laying on the beach. He was in the bed, sleep. It was all kind of shit. Oh my god. I would love to have that meme of Conor McGregor, man. The referee, you robbed us of that meme. You robbed us of that meme. How dare you? <laughs> Can you imagine? Just, he'll be everywhere. I would like put him on the countertop at a Dunkin' Donuts restaurant. Just <laughs> like he got the itis from eating so many donuts and got knocked out. Oh my God. Man, we got robbed of that meme. But it was cool. Hopefully this KSI um, Jake Paul thing is going to be as spectacularly entertaining as uh, this fight here was. Because it's not a real fight. We're not even going to go there. It's just entertainment. Hopefully, you know, they actually get in the ring and, like, do some crazy shit. It's probably going to be a wild prank. Where, like, they're probably going to, like, blow each other up with, like, a bunch of, like, stink bombs or some shit while they're in the ring. You know how these guys go. It's going to be something wacky. Something outrageous. Outlandish. But, yeah, shout out to Robert Frank. Robert Frank was in there, man. Like I said, if anyone could get anybody revved up for a fight, it's this guy here. Get out of it, bro! Let's go! Jack Tan and Juice. Don't read his fucking shirt! Are you ready to do this or what? I was just. Uh, uh, you were just what? I was just. Uh, what were you just? I was just. I was just reading this shirt. He's Jack! <laughs> He's Jack. <laughs> <laughs> oh shit, look at these clowns again. Uh, here's the thing. Oh my. Greg challenged me. He challenged me. Challenged me. Keto. Shut up. Alright, we had enough of that fraudulent shit. If you guys haven't already done so, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Subscribe, subscribe, subscribe. I am subliminally in your mind right now. I think this shit actually works because my subs are, they're going up. I was at like 1,108. Now I'm like at 1,160 something. Damn, this shit actually works. Let me start over. <clears throat> I am subliminally in your mind 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 you are now subscribing to the channel i think people like the channel it's not getting a lot of like exposure yet because the recommended thing is hard to get recommended on youtube that's how some people blow up but the people who are finding it they are subbing you know so that means i'm doing something right don't worry people i got some new fight videos coming up it's gonna be fucking epic um that's for all the haters out there because i actually trained real fighting since i was a kid 
been doing this shit since I was a wee lad. You know, the, the martial arts expert himself is going to be teaching you guys all sorts of moves. So when those haters get bold and want to take it off the internet and threaten to come get you and show up at places where they know you're going to be at and do things to you, well, guess what? You're going to have one of those moves that I taught you on how to defend yourself. Remember, defense is okay to break someone's arm or their hand when it's defense. So, <laughs> anyway, let me get back to the video with all that said. Get to the gym. Do well, that don't even match. It's not even really like a gym video, is it? But it doesn't matter because my whole presence is this. Get to the gym. Do work. And muscle up. My adversaries cry like hoes. Fully eradicate my foes. My lyrics explode on contact. Came in you hoes. Who else but mama's only fun? But the phony niggas up the Say my name, watch bitches come. Now fire when ready, stay watching now. 